Alrighty, let's put this in full first. Of course I have superpowers. I have super strength, I can fly, I have laser vision, all the good stuff. It's just, you know, I gotta keep it on the down low. Of course I- all right, all right, very cool. So you would like to finish this, so I'm gonna go through and just kind of mention the broader things, the things that stand out. One thing is, this is just because, I know, it's probably not, I don't know where you have the audio from. It's like, I wish I had 10 more frames, 15 more frames, that we don't cut out so quickly. This is like a super tiny, tiny thing, but I'm just wondering if you had access to the full clip, wherever this is from. Of course I have super powers. The main thing that I'm seeing here, and this is, this is tricky. Actually, let me let me find another player. The main reason I'm bringing this up is because of the lip sync. Of course, I have superpowers. I have super strength. I... The lip sync just seems off. Of course, I have superpowers. And if I even play it here, but sometimes you never know. Of course, I have superpowers. I have super strength. I can. But just watching this, it's definitely off. So the biggest thing to me would be to kind of relook at, at reference. Of course, I have superpowers. I have super strength. I have laser vision, all the good stuff. It's just, you know, I gotta keep it on the down low. Yeah, I think body wise, if you watch this again with sound here. Of course, I have superpowers. I have super strength. I can fly. I have laser vision, all the good stuff. It's just, I laser think vision, all the good stuff. That is a bit good strong. Stuff. That move over. I would just reduce that a bit and make sure there's also enough of a uh, up down in the hips, not just in Y, but pushing because she's resting on that so it should be I'm exaggerating but someone like this in terms of your hips right and then as you move over more weight goes onto this so your hips will stabilize a bit more and then she starts to be a bit more with this leg so it will go up a bit more here you know I gotta keep it on the down low that to me is the one I thing I would check out let me just turn on the saw the sound here because everything else works pretty well the only other thing I would say is because of that fast move, it also takes the whole body with it. So if you look at this drop of this arm, it goes left, 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 and you feel like it wants to continue swinging over where that hand would be here, but then it doesn't because the root brings it over. So if you look at this, this comes over to the left and it whoop, immediately goes to the right. And in real time, bam, that feels a bit strange. Not that she's all floppy and swingy, but I would still have, I mean, I would personally reduce the amount going over and even your stop is a bit abrupt if you look at this line and then it stops right there and has that strange pivot where it just kind of pivot off uh, off of here then it continues a bit to me it's a bit of a mix of just reducing i mean if you reduce the amount it's going to already be slower so same timing but different distance it's going to slow it down but even then, I would watch out that this arm keeps on swinging a bit more and then comes back into this. I mean, you can lead and join that move here. This feels a bit even in timing. That going up here. Same thing with this hand changing and compressing. And again, arc-wise, like, to me, I know you want to finish this, but these are to me things that you would really pay attention to. As this wrist goes up, I'm just tracking kind of roughly the top part, but you can see how that top part just goes shpoof, right there. So really pay attention to the spacing and the arcs and some of those moments. Even this here at the end, that, that elbow move, or that shoulder move, sorry. It's kind of separate. I don't mind like a separate move like this, but it just feels a bit too much. I would cut that down maybe in half for a slight adjustment because it really takes the whole arm with it into that. But I don't mind the mechanics of it, kind of having a talk and then kind of readjusting before she gets back up. I don't mind that. It just feels a bit too accentuated and a bit too big there. But you already have some changes in the wrist and fingers. That's good, but again, you're moving your body this way and the hand this way. So as it goes over to the left, you're starting it translate to the left. But then again, if I would just track this, it's gonna be super boring to watch. But if I'm tracking kinda this part of the wrist really horribly, oh, too high. But anyway, you can see what's going on here. It just goes left, boom, and then down into something like this. 
again looking at your arcs and your and your spacing like in here it's not bad on bigger moves i don't mind stuff like that the only thing i would say here is that to take your arm and move it out a bit more so you don't have a tangent right there with the hair and the wrist like even that's better like that will feel okay and i know you just want to you want to get this done but <laughs> you're paying me and i want to i want to tell you everything it's totally up to you what you want to incorporate but again uh if i'm looking at what this wrist is doing as it goes up into something like this this just feels very harsh where it's fairly straightish it's a bit of an arc but then bam big change there and then fairly flat i was again look at your arc so even this here a bit harsh because you got a moment where like this all moves as one and then it just kind of goes up and then stops down. And I know you're getting into the wavy part, but I would still get at least one more frame of ease in to then change direction. So every now and then you got some uh, some harsher parts. The other thing, this, she feels fairly crazy with so much white. Like she's ready to eat that child. So I would just lower the head a bit so that, you know, that line kind of almost covers the pupil. So she's a bit more relaxed like that's a nice that's like that to me is the thing that she has like this is the tone and an attitude even here it gets a bit white but it's okay it's just i'm slightly concerned about how intense that look is here at the beginning here i will bring out that eye a bit more to the right so it's not so like here and this one goes out this way she just got some moments here and there that you can look at where this feels like we're really losing the pupils i would cheat and bring those out a bit bit more so we see a bit more of these same thing she gets a bit cross-eyed here her eyes but it might just be that thing right there it's not that's not a big one i think that works okay again we are a bit low you start it feels like you're almost halfway to the pupil i would bring the pupils a bit higher that's totally fine <laughs> still love this that's great even this here you might also have to just kind of so maybe she's not so straight towards us anyway maybe go a bit more looking this way which gives us a bit more room to bring those eyes over there because then what you can do is by having that face more turned like that towards the girl you can then turn towards us for this on that blink she would turn more and then end up in this head position that's really great by the way i love that that's your good little concern look at that moment it's cute. It's good stuff in the eyebrows there too. Let's watch out that it's not too separate where like one corner of the eyebrow moves more than the other. You want to make them feel connected. This just puts a bit much here, how this moves separately. So of course I've gone way into detail now. I know you want this to be over, but feel free to just take this and ignore whatever you want to ignore. And the last thing is there's something where an overall white shape is in the mouth all the time. Let's go back to uh, actually turning on the lip sync hair. Oh, the audio. Of course I have superpowers. I know, there's something where she doesn't strike me as so wide mouthy. And if you listen to the audio, of course I have superpowers. I have super strength. I can like strength would be okay. Strength. I can fly. Even fly, but this this feels more like ah, like really strong. I would just take all of these shapes and reduce those by twenty percent. Even like all the good stuff, like just feels more contained where it's just more closer together. It's just like that, that to me feels better. Just, you know. But then even here, then you go into like a really big change of only this corner is moving. And then this corner comes up into like a rah rah, it gets a bit too swimmy here. You know, I gotta keep it on the down low. And then the end, that works better to me, but there's just something about the shapes. Besides being not in sync, just watch out for that one. I would just reduce the amount of, of opening and whiteness. I have superpowers. I have super strength. I can and push it a bit more in terms of I have super strength. Where it's more like that. I have super the more contained. That's great. And then super strength. strength. But then the strength it feels more strength. Where's the strength? Where it corners out and see more teeth. The mouth a bit close together. Strength. I can fly. I and then I can fly. I don't see the F here. Let's go crazy and scrub here. Super I, I, can fly. 
I mean, you can hear here how the sink is off, but like this is your fly. I can fly. So your limb, your sink is definitely off, but I don't see the F. I can fly. There's a really big moment where she, where she really links on that. I can fly. Laser vision again. A v. So that's kind of the stuff that I would have kind of paid attention to. I know I want to keep this much shorter, but you know, again, like I said, pick and choose what you want to choose. I want to give you all my thoughts because that's what you are paying me for, and I want to make sure that um, I'm not giving you like a one-minute critique here. And that is that. All right. Thanks. All right. There's an email, you can sign up, you can start whenever you want, you can submit whenever you want, you get 16 submissions. Either way, a like and subscribe would be awesome. All right, thank you.